Okay, this is a follow-up video to my cloning video that I did. Um, someone had posted saying, hey, how did the cloning go? Well, I cloned two plants, and the, the plants that I cloned were called Big Beef. I love them. In fact, here's a Big Beef. This is not a clone, but this is my Big Beef uh, my Big Beef tomato plant. This is where this is the plant I, res I got the clone from. By the way, let me show you this little offshoot that came out here. And I went ahead and tied it up to there. Let me get a little back shot. This thing is ridiculously high. It's about 10 feet tall. That is where the clone came from. And here is the clone now. It's doing very well. Let me just point out a couple things here. I'm gonna get I'm getting ready to trim these off because they're touching the ground. And that one there. What's interesting is, I'm gonna just show you here. It came up and actually split in two, but it's doing great. As you can see, I got some blossoms there, getting ready to kick out some uh, tomatoes. Got another one there. It is doing extremely well. I do want to say the one thing that I want to say about this is I put the clone, as you, if you watch the clone video, um, I put it in peat moss, a little peat moss cup. I kept it in the peat moss cup until I saw the roots coming out. When I saw these little tiny hairs coming out of the uh, peat moss, that's when I went ahead and put it in the ground, and it worked out extremely well. Um, so it had a really nice root system, and I put the peat moss uh, cup, everything, into the ground, and um, as you can see the soil there, this is sand in Florida, but I really dug it up and uh, it's uh, some miracle Grow soil in there. So it's doing great and I highly recommend, it's very easy, I highly recommend cloning tomato plants, the ones that you like. Once again, uh, this, and I'll, I'll go ahead and update this later on in the summer so you all can see how this thing turned out. Uh, thanks a lot for watching my videos. Bye.